I was reading a story. Oh, really? Yeah. Was it porn? Nope. Okay. About the very last surviving member of an indigenous people group in Brazil. He finally just passed away of natural causes, and the total genocide of the people is now complete. He was, for the last 26 years, living alone, untouched. They left him supplies, things of that nature. He was referred to as the man of the hole because he would dig holes to catch animals and he'd also hide in holes. But when I read man of the hole, I thought of you. Nice. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction. It's Corbin. I'm Rick. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more. Yes. Thanks on Patreon. Follow us Twitter account. Subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> Kombucha. It's good for your poop. Also, call your mom and say, ah, ah, ah. she'll know what it means. <laughs> but you got to do it FaceTime, kids. <laughs> Doesn't mean as much unless she can see what you're doing. Just tell her it's for me. She'll, she'll know what it means. Uh, it's true. Just say, Corbin told me to say, ah, ah, ah. Today we got a first look teaser of Vishal Bardawashi's new film. First look teaser. Kuchia? Yeah. Is Kuchi that? Kuchi. <laughs> Kulfia. That makes me think of the ice cream. Kulf, kul, kulfi. 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 I'm not crazy. Kulfia. Kulfio. Bengali. Uh, <laughs> starring uh a, a dosed in uh, it's true. Ali Faisal. And a future dose. And a future dose, hopefully, in Taboo. Uh, and uh, it's obviously uh, directed by Vishal Bardwash, is the first teaser of this. A mystery has been brewing. Yeah. That all... That's all we can tell you for now. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Cool. Excellent. Uh, and it's a Netflix film as well. So. Hey, shout out to Netflix India, man. They have been making some serious garbage. Complete serious and utter garbage. Contracts with all of the movies. Movers and shakers in Indian cinema, the studios and stuff. I was reading it in Variety today, how Netflix India is making a a concerted effort for the future of OTT in India. So whatever they're not doing internationally well, they're starting to do really well. I don't know what they're doing as far as their prices are concerned, but... Sorry, I wasn't listening. What did you say? What else is no? Oh, okay. Here we go. Nope, that's the wrong, that's the wrong speaker. I love taboo. Uh, I was hoping it was a different word. I love taboo. And that's a taboo subject. It's a double. That's her. Thanks. a bird. Do you think he composed the background score? I bet yes, he did. I bet he did. I bet he did because it was amazing. Um, yeah, it looks... <laughs> a mystery is brewing... And uh, I'm hoping I think that's all they can tell us for now. (laughs) (laughs) Hmm, I wonder where I think I think I think Ali Faisal is going to laugh. I think she's going to light a cigarette. I'm hoping we get a someone's going to scream really loud and she's going to smoke. You've read you're going to see it. You've read the stereotypical cigarette after sex. (sighs) I know you don't smoke now. But you've had sex before now, I think. I may have, (laughs) because there was a very small period of time where I was trying to smoke. Did you never, how did you try to smoke? Okay, so I was, the character I was playing in this play, uh, uh, he was a smoker, and I I wanted, uh, I was smoking during the day, and the most I could do was like four cigarettes a day. I can't remember... If I lit up after sex with Cindy, we'd have to ask Cindy. She'd remember. She lit up. Hey. Damn straight. Sorry, Kenny. That's her husband. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
is, this is weird. Uh, <laughs> I'm hoping we... They're really great friends still to this day, and Kenny and, and Cindy have been married for... They, they got together right after she and I broke up back in 19... How did she She's like, okay, this is what I don't want. Just look at him. Uh, <laughs> what? It was a joke. Oh, got it. <laughs> You're funny. Yeah, I know. I'm hoping we get, even though we've gotten plenty of great performances from Ali Faisal, I'm hoping we get like a header performance. That that little That's Shakespeare. That little, that little. Anyway, yes, I'm aware it's Shakespeare, but it was an adaption by Vishal Bardwaj. Yeah, it was, but this isn't an adaption of Shakespeare. Yes, because he's the only one who can write crazy. I'm saying I want. I'm. I'm hoping we get kind of because that 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 little laugh wasn't just a regular laugh. That was almost like a he's going a little crazy laugh. You couldn't hear it. You don't know what he was Shut laughing the at. Fuck you up. have no idea. Um, That's like somebody saying someone's going to win an Oscar based on a photograph. I'm always right. No, it's not true. But you were right on that one. I'm probably going to be right this year too. Yeah. yeah. Did we tell you about that? I'm we probably- were we were we were watching a movie and the trailer came on for Kate Blanchett's new film. And it ended, and he said, she's going to win the Oscar for that. And I said, I am not betting you money on that at all. I am not, because I lost $100 to him on the whole freaking Gary Oldman thing. Uh, for uh, He straight up Darkest Hour. sent me the photo it of was, him in character before it, Darkest Hour. It was they were the, filming Darkest Hour. Yeah, it was the poster of Darkest Hour. It was just the poster of his makeup, and he said, give the man his Oscar already. And I said, you're a moron. He said, bet me. So we bet $100, and he won the freaking we went And we got to meet him that year, too. It's we we went to Oldman's screening at that SAG and got to meet Gary Oldman. Really nice guy. It's like I just bet on good actors. It's like if if Fahat Fasil was going to be in a a name a great um, American director film, right? Christopher Nolan. Sure. Uh, well, maybe not him because he doesn't make Oscar films. He makes more massive. Steven films. Spielberg. M- more massive. I'm saying like if he was in a. Um, who did the... Uh, the you know, no one's been nominated for more Best Pictures than Steven Spielberg. Who gives a shit? Um, the, who did Grand Budapest? Why am I forgetting his name? Christian, Hans Christian Anderson. <laughs> it's Wes Anderson. Thank you. <laughs> if he was in like a Wes Anderson film or like a, a Quentin Tarantino film, yeah, and like he came out with a poster and yeah. it looked epic, I'd be like, Fafa's going to win a... Fafa's yeah, but that's, win that's different than actually it happening. And the only reason I'm saying an American artist because it's... That would just give him a direct line to the Oscars. So you're saying right here in front of everybody that your expectation, based on that laugh, is, is Ali that Faisal. Ali Faisal yes. is going to win an Oscar. Yes. Okay. You heard it here first, 100 folks. bucks, Ali Faisal, <laughs> Vishal Bardwash, and Taboo. They're all going to win Oscars. Triple, actually, Vishal's going to win two. Yep. Director and, and score. Co- score. Yeah. <laughs> and the world will know their names. Yep. Uh, well, they know Taboo's name, and they know Vishal Bardwash's name. Unfortunately, they and don't. The, a lot of the world know Ali Faisal. I don't think they know their names. I think they'll they'll know their face. Did you ever see uh, Victoria? The, no, the, I never saw. Him. Oh, Victoria and Abdul. Yeah, this really, one really really good. Although, that, I was introduced to him in that before OS, although, or, OSR. The fact that this has obviously, even though they're not crazy recognizable here, even though they're probably two of the more recognizable ones. Yeah, uh, Taboo and and uh, Ali Faisal. The um, this has a good chance, obviously, depending on how it ends. If Michelle Bardo show, it's probably going to be good, of reaching some yeah. more uh, Western audiences. And we've said it like a broken record, but one of the reasons for that is because, like I mentioned, a, a friend of mine is saying they see more and more recommendations to watch Indian films because of the success of RRR. Yep. So more people are going to watch this because it's going to get recommended on Netflix. Because so many people who watch RRR are going to get Indian film recommendations, and this will be a new release. Coming soon, which is so, great. And it's weird because it's it's a Netflix film. They're yeah. releasing a first look teaser, and there's no release date yet. So I wonder when it's going to come out. Anyways, let us know what you thought about the teaser and uh, uh, how's how's dinner. If it's Bengali, is it Gudo? It's going to be all day today. Just-